If you guys are anything like me, you have terabytes and terabytes of photos and videos just piling up on your computer at home. The computer behind me, it's jam-packed, and every time I leave the house, it's something that weighs on my mind, thinking, if this place burns down, all of my files are gone, but not anymore. I wanna share a service with you that I've been using for a while, and that is Backblaze. Now, right off the bat, Backblaze isn't paying me to do this review. This is actually a service that I'm so happy with that I actually wanna share it with you guys because I know that this is something that I've been struggling with for a while, making sure that all of my files are securely backed up to a cloud service. And if you wanna check them out, check out the link in the description. It is an affiliate link, but you can get a little bit more information if you have any questions during the length of this video. And you can even get a 30 day free trial if it is something that you think you would be interested in. You can see if it'll work for you. The value of this service is unlike anything I've seen from any of its competitors. And I'm gonna start off with the price. Now you can either pay monthly, yearly, or every two years. Now monthly, it's only six bucks a month. Or if you pay for the entire year, it's just $60. So for the price of like a coffee at Starbucks, you could have a monthly backup of all of the files on your computer. And here's the best thing. There is no limit. So on this computer back here, I have 19 terabytes of potential storage on my computer. And that's only gonna cost me $5 and a few cents every month for that yearly rate to back up everything on my computer. Now there's some stuff on here I don't wanna back up. And that's one of the great things about Backblaze is that in their control panel, you can actually go in and select which files or folders you don't wanna back up or even entire hard drives. Now, in terms of hard drives, obviously it's gonna back up all of the files from the internal storage on your computer. But not only that, if you have external hard drives plugged into the USB ports of your computer, it will back up all of those too. So think about it. I have 19 terabytes inside this computer and then I've got another 16 terabytes on external hard drives. Of course, that's not a great solution and those hard drives are on borrowed time because I've had them for several years now and that's the beauty of it. If those hard drives die out, you'll have them safe and sound on Backblaze's servers for an extended period of time where you can then download it. So let's say worst case scenario, your house burns down, you've got 20 plus terabytes on your computer at home, and then what? You build a new computer and then you have to download 20 terabytes? How long will that take? Maybe if you have fast internet, it won't take too long, but Backblaze actually has a smarter solution than that. For no additional cost, Backblaze will send you up to an eight terabyte drive to your house with all of your data on it that you can then take off that hard drive and put onto your computer so you don't have to deal with any of the downloading, any of the crazy amounts of data going through your internet, bogging everything down, and maybe you have uh, an internet cap like I do, unfortunately, and I really don't wanna have to deal with downloading 20 terabytes of data. So at the end of it, you send the drive back, you're not charged for it, but maybe you do wanna keep the drive and Backblaze charges you, I would say a fairly um, reasonable market rate for that hard drive. Backblaze also gives you an option of how fast you want to upload your data to their servers. And you can fiddle with this for whatever works for you. I know sometimes I actually wanna pause the upload when I'm uploading some more critical stuff for work or if there's, if I'm playing games, I don't wanna have that additional data going up. So I can just pause it and without even having to think about it, a few hours later, Backblaze will just start it up again and get going. There's even another cool function that I haven't even really considered before, and that is the function to find your computer if it's been stolen. Now, if you have a laptop, you know that somebody wants that laptop and somebody will go out of their way to steal it and Backblaze has you covered. All of your files, of course, will be backed up. You don't have to worry about that, but they have the ability to track your laptop and where it is. 
It can tell you the internet service provider that the laptop is hooked up to, its IP address, and it'll give you a better chance of getting your precious laptop returned to you. So let's say you have a network attached storage. Backblaze has an answer for that too. It's called Backblaze B2. Now for Backblaze B2, they don't charge a flat rate for all of your data. They actually charge on what you use. So let's say you use a terabyte versus somebody who uses 100 terabytes. Your price is gonna vary. Now their price is actually a half cent a gigabyte. So let's put that in terms of terabytes because I think that's probably a little bit easier for you to understand. It's about five bucks a terabyte. So you can see how maybe if you have a solution for Amazon and you have 100 terabytes on Amazon, you're paying out the nose for that amount of data. But on Backblaze, you'd actually be paying a significant amount less. And if you do have your data already backed up on Amazon servers, Backblaze will actually pay up to a certain amount to migrate that over to their servers, which is honestly a huge, huge plus. Now, while you might be thinking that this is way, way cheaper than something like Dropbox or Google Drive, which honestly, it really is, it isn't really designed to function the same way. Dropbox and Google Drive, you know, obviously they're a cloud service, but in my opinion, they're meant for more sharing files. And while you can share files through Backblaze, you are limited to the amount of files that you can share every month. But what this is really for is just that safety and security and peace of mind, because I know that there have been a few times where I've been out on vacation or hell, even just away from home. And I'm just thinking in the back of my mind, what if everything burns down and I lose all of my life's work, I'd be devastated. And this really is what gives me peace of mind knowing that I don't have to worry about that anymore. And I definitely think that is worth the five to six bucks a month. And like I said, Backblaze is not sponsoring me to do this. There is an affiliate link down in the description. So if you wanna click on those, you can get a little bit more information. Obviously, there's no pressure. And in fact, they actually have a free 30 day trial to see if it is something that's easy for you or something that you like. So check out the link in the description if you think that this is something that may interest you because I know that I've been checking out all of the different cloud services and this is the one that seemed the cheapest, the easiest, and the most reliable that I would trust all of my data with. So again, check them out. Let me know down below if you have any other questions about their service that either I or they couldn't answer because um, I'm telling you right now, I'm running it as we speak and it's something that I really, really am happy that I found. So thank you guys for watching the entire video and I will see you on the next one.